It's just got too much energy, hey, every trick he does just learns tricks like that. Yeah! My son's got a talent. Yep. He's, he's got perfect balance. He's a bit crazy and uh, the energy that goes with that is unstoppable. Yeah, so Preston came out, Thrasher filmer, mm. and um, he came on tour with us for, you know, two weeks, and and he sort of said, like, you know, was amazed by Zach, his, his personality, his skill, his enthusiasm, and at the end of the day, he was just like, that. no matter where that guy ends up, he's always going to be with around good people and end up on his own feet, you know, so, definitely, yeah, he's an amazing kid. Bloody hell, furthest trail is his skate mecca. Oh, what's going on here? The chant himself, Zach, Zach Wilmore. Zach Wilmore gets his crooks on down an unlucky number of stairs at Hillcrest Primary School. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, this kid's an absolute bloody champ. gardener's shed. It's quite a tall shed. Yep. And um, we were all sitting on the top of that shed watching him, you know, during the day. And everybody wanted Zach to jump off the roof of that shed. And I was petrified. But I said, go on Zach, go hard, be really careful, but go for it. And I watched my son jump skate up in that small amount of roof and clear it and jump down onto the ground and turn his deck right around without even falling. Yep. It's perfect balance. And I knew then my son's a champ. He is a champ. He's exceptional. Because if he can do that, he can do anything. Is he popular? He's nuts, you believe? He's number one in Australia at the moment. Yeah, yeah, I just won the Australian Challenge. Yeah! I'm Aboriginal. I'm Aboriginal through and through. Zach, he's got my genetics, I believe. It's all in the balance, I always told him. He's got it in the arms. It all comes from his Yamaji background. <laughs> Uh, well, I pretty much skate every day. I can't help it. Like, if I don't skate, then I'm sitting around, I'm like, oh, twitching because i got so much energy, i just got to go out and do something with myself. Like, I, so I can't sit around. Skateboarding is just like something I have to do. Well, like, it's always been popular, but I reckon over the last year or so, it's definitely escalated, like, 
amazing. So many little kids and stuff, and their parents are like want to get involved with them, taking them down the skate park and stuff like that. And so many more parks getting built everywhere. That's what we need, but. Twenty seconds left in this section. Backside slip to him, Zach Rumble. Yeah, it didn't surprise me at all. He definitely skated the best on the day, and it was nice to be around, you know, 15, 20 people from Perth that had travel, all travelled to Melbourne just to watch Zach do well, and he actually did do well. So, you know, yeah. everyone was pretty amped. Steve Hill, Peter Hill, thanks for everything. I wasn't surprised. I felt, if anything, he deserved it because of his application, because of his spirit, because of his sheer tenacity that he gets when he's out there and he's rolling. He loves it and I love watching him like that because it's so positive for him. Some of the skateboarders from around the world are amazing at the moment and it just keeps getting better and better. They just keep pushing the limit. One more time, let's make some noise. But that's kind of what I need as well. See, like being in Perth and stuff is pretty isolated, you know. I tend to just relax and not find myself not pushing myself, so I need to get out there and skate with those kind of dudes as well. Zach Wilmore, Crooked Girl! Right now it's probably just uh, geography, really. You know, he's in Perth, one of the most isolated cities in the world. You know, there's the barrier to get to the eastern states, which, you know, financially is a quite a big barrier. To go internationally, you know, you're looking 1,500 to 2,000 instantly. So how, how? We're looking at funding, and we're looking at a few fundraisers that we can do, um, you know, in preparation for Zach's trip to Europe. If he gets to travel, I think we'll inspire a lot of the Perth skaters. Perth skating, Everyone has pride in anyone that gets out of Perth and does really well. So, so if Zach does well in Melbourne, in Europe, in America, everyone does well. He is an inspiration to young people and older people to have more planning, you know, with skate parks in our community for the future. It makes you want to skate. Zach! Look, not the board! Go, Zach! Go, Zach!